It's mid-January and time to start preserving the remaining butternut squash from last year's garden. Today we are going to prepare them for drying. We like to grow the butternuts because they are so versatile. They can replace pumpkin in a pie and make a thick, rich soup. They keep a long time and their smooth skin makes them easy to peel and prepare. Our plants have been very productive and these squash are unusually large, some weighing over five pounds. After peeling and removing the soft insides and seeds, they are cut into chunks that will fit into the mouth of the food processor. This batch will be shredded to use in making squash fritters. The food processor makes the job easy. Like most vegetables eaten cooked, the squash is blanched in boiling water. After cooling in cold water, the squash is poured into the colander to drain. Next, they are arranged on dehydrator trays and left to dry overnight. In the morning, it is put into wide mouth canning jars, sealed and labeled. Because we had more squash than space on the trays, we used the leftovers to make a batch of squash fritters for breakfast. We used five cups of shredded squash, two eggs, two-thirds of a cup of flour, some salt and pepper and oil for frying. Mixed all together and fried for five minutes per side. Unlike potatoes, the squash fritters hardly absorb any oil when frying. We like them served plain or with sour cream. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you want to see more, please subscribe and share it with your friends. Until next time, this has been Homestead Homebodies. Thanks for watching.